His face falls. Why does he look so nervous? That's... Why don't you ask Reese later? Uh-huh. Hint. Hint. <laughs> <laughs> Is that his cat? Did he name it or something? Is it a bad name? Come over juicy details. <laughs> juicy details. N no, he's... Graves should have told you about him. Mm. Let's get to work. It's time to open. Uh, Landry <laughs> isn't having any more of this. He walks past me to the front door without a glance. He unlocks it, flips a sign from close to open. And ta-da! Your first day at a cat's paw has begun. And... Nobody's here. Well, this is a little anticlimactic. <laughs> yeah. The mornings are usually pretty slow. It might pick up later. <laughs> might. <laughs> it didn't. At all. All day. <laughs> sure, a few people came in, and Landry had me wait their tables while he supervised. It went pretty well, and I made a couple bucks in tips, but that was it. It's a couple more bucks you you had when you leave than when you went in, right? <laughs> yeah. Finley came down a couple of times to check in, and I saw Mason and Hayes every time I went to the kitchen, but I didn't see Reese at all. Reese's bobtailed cat, on the other hand, was all over the place. I think I see why he'd take a shine to this one. They're both complete hams. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's what you gotta call it. Ham. Yeah. <laughs> Not that I mind that it was slow. It just meant I got to play with the cats more. There are like 10 of them here? Maybe? 50? Well, let's see, 200. there's Jam Band and I <laughs> and Juice. I can't get a solid count on them. They seem to vanish sometimes. Looks like there are a lot of areas around here for them to hide. Thank you for your help today, Avery. That was really weird because it was Landry speaking, but Finley. Yeah, but Finley like, popped out. I was about to go all Finley, and I'm like, oh, wait, no, that says Landry. Oh, huh. wow. Well. That's Landry, awkward. Finley, and I finished wiping down the tables. Mason was gone before the cafe closed. I don't know where Hayes went. So, how'd you like it? <laughs> Is it always this quiet? I mean, not that I'm complaining. Not always. Tomorrow should be busier, for sure. I've got plans. Oh, we should get here early then, huh? Don't say that like you aren't always early. Weak. <laughs> oh, I have to come in earlier? Don't worry too much about it, Avery. Just show up at your regular time. Which apparently is 8, because it's been all one time. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, thanks. Noon it is. <laughs> I can't imagine what busy means here. Like, what, six people in here at the same time? Wow, that's kind of rude. <laughs> I've got a little more work I want to do on the blog, so you all go ahead. I'll close up if Graves doesn't get here to do it. Oh, thank you. Avery, you can head out. Thanks. Are you leaving now? I could walk you home. Woo-woo. Uh, I'll, I'll be out in a bit. You go on ahead. <laughs> ah! You checked in. Oh, all right. <laughs> Thought I'll we'd snag one of them week. tonight. Damn. <laughs> I'll see y'all tomorrow. Night. Well, that was fun. The door closes behind me with a jingle. Jingle, jingle, jingle. I have a job. <laughs> uh, my coworkers are really freaking cute. And I get to play with cats. See, I was hoping we we would say my coworkers are pretty cute and the people aren't bad either. <laughs> 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 Whatever. And if this works out, I should be able to afford a place of my own soon. Like what? It's been one day, bro. You got two yeah. bucks. <laughs> Dude, I've been working since I've 18 and I'm about to barely be able to afford my own place. The heck you talking about? Wait until my parents hear about this. Just so like way into this we're like yeah our first job we've got this <laughs> i guess that 
You know, that kind of is probably, like, the feeling most people have with their first job after they're, like, graduated and, like, they're not in school anymore, so they're like, all right, I gotta be an adult now. I gotta move out! <laughs> Goal number one! <laughs> Meanwhile, one I'm just like, I need a car that functions... I need video games, I need taxes. more video games, taxes, food that is pizza, games, a car that functions, pizza, yeah. Yeah. I'm feeling Other priorities. pretty good right now. I can't help giving a little celebratory fist pump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I think I just heard someone snort a laugh behind me. <laughs> I thought I said that pretty quietly. I turn around to see who it is, but there's nobody there but a cat. <laughs> Oh, two cats, actually. Cats from the cafe. Hi, I know who you two are. Reese's cat and the Siamese, to be precise. Crap, wait, how'd they get outside? Did I let them out when I left? This is real bad. I'm pretty sure one of the first rules of working at a cafe is cat... A cat fae. It's a cat fae. Beautiful. No one we can do yes. that. It's a cat fae. One of the first rules of working at a cat fae is to do not lose the cats. <laughs> That's probably accurate. They're not looking at me anymore. Now's my chance. I start creeping towards both cats. Aw, oh, you're gonna scare them. If I move too suddenly, I might spook them. If you just snatch them up, you're gonna spook them. I only make it a few steps before I see the bobtail's ears swivel back to face me. Without turning the rest of its head, it takes a springy leap and heads down one of the forking paths. The Siamese cat continues down the same path, as casual as anything. I can't get them both, but I need to get at least one of them. So, Siamese. Oh, I better decide who to go after. I don't want to spook our totally mysterious Siamese cat friend. <laughs> then do you want to go after Hyper there? What do you think, Hollow? Siamese. Oh, all right, let's spook him. <laughs> spook him. I'm sorry, please love me. <laughs> The bobtail's on to me, clearly, but the Siamese cat hasn't picked up on it yet. Oh yeah, no, this was strategy, not preference. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> My best chance right now is probably following the Siamese. It's kind of gotten far down the path. I better pick up my pace to catch up. I try to mimic those long strides Landry always takes to cover more ground, but that doesn't work out so well. Jogging's gonna be easier. Or not. My feet are falling hard on the ground, the cat notices. It's going faster now, so I gotta pick up the pace. I break out in a full run to follow him. Ah, you're spooping him. He definitely knows I'm there now, but it doesn't <laughs> matter. I have bigger legs, so I'm gonna catch up sooner or later. Because you've never chased a cat before, right? Obviously not. They're gone in like a second. I'm a pretty good runner. I could totally run outrun this car. Yup. <laughs> nope. I finally close the gap between us. Suddenly, the cat screeches to a halt and jerks around to face me. Oh, right. That's actually, yeah. Good <laughs> cat. Uh, Avery, stop it. Eh? <laughs> Why are you chasing me? Because you got out. Wait, what am I saying? <laughs> what are you saying? How are you saying? It's me. Me? Hayes! Last I checked, Hayes was a guy with glasses. <laughs> you don't seem like the pranking type, Hayes. The Hayes cat is puffing up like a dusting brush. Oh gosh. <laughs> I feel like this cat's getting caught up in whatever shenanigans they're trying to put me through right now. Ah, what a wonderful word, shenanigans. <laughs> this seems like it should be against work procedure. Oh god, who even- Oh, okay, no, I think I know. Okay, he's telling the truth, Avery. The voice comes from behind me. I whirl around to see Landry, but he's not there. Down here. I readjust my gaze downward. Oh, come on. No, this- This isn't a joke, Avery. Landry Cat takes a few steps past me and sits down in front of Hayes Cat. He even has the main coon. His gait is long. Like, damn, boy. I mean, oh, wait, no, 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 come on, no, 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 no. Graves didn't tell you? Tell me what? They were all secret cats? This doesn't make any sense. I, this is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I'm sorry, Avery, I thought he'd told you. Is that why you were acting weird? 
You were keeping something this bonkers a secret? Bonkers is a cat. <laughs> <laughs> he's a cartoon cat, but a cat. I think he's technically a cat. Mm. It's not easy to talk about. Whenever we leave the cafe grounds, we turn into cats. <gasps> That's dope. I mean, wait, what? <laughs> I'm surprised to hear Hayes pipe up of all people. Or all cats. Wait, does that mean we can't take them on dates outside of the cafe? <gasps> no. But wait, wait. Why would we want to date anybody outside of the cafe, though? True. True. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But amusement parks. Oh, that would be so cute just to have like a kitty cat around your shoulders while you go up on a ferris wheel i'm pretty sure they don't allow that uh well if they're hidden in your hood it began around the time we started to work here uh graves calls it a curse a curse a curse this is way too much though so, i don't know if Everyone thinks of it that way. But wait. Everyone? Is everybody at the cafe a secret cat? Y- yes. Graves too? Nobody has seen him as a cat. We have. <laughs> but it seems safe to assume. Am I going to turn to a cat too? I hope so. We'd be an adorable cat. <laughs> Landry isn't even looking at me anymore. He's avoiding eye contact so as hard as he can. Uh, oh, Hayes does the same. Neither answers. My face. <gasps> I'm gonna turn into a cat. Oh, yes. God. <laughs> there, there are two responses to "I'm gonna turn into a cat," and it's either death. Or, or yes. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm down with being a secret cat. Like, yep. Hollow, secret hollow, cat. Hollow, hollow, secret mm-hmm. cat. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. All right. We're all good. So, sorry, Avery. Maybe you can stop it. We don't know what causes the curse. Maybe if you talk to the others tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Why not? <laughs> Let's have the whole cat council. We can invite hash browns too. Is he also a person? I'm gonna guess by the fact that his name is Hash Browns. It's a no. I can see the fur between Hayes' shoulders rising on end, on end in a little ridge. Seeing that takes the wind right out of my sails a little bit. Oh, I sorry, Hayes, baby. Oh. <sighs> yeah. All right. I'm too tired for this. I didn't mean to yell at you. I love you. <laughs> Kiss me later. I mean, bye. This better be a weird dream or something. A weird re- work-induced hallucination. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Sorry, Avery. Stop saying that! <laughs> Not listening to talking cats anymore. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> the sun's barely gone down, but I'm capital letter D done with today. This is too much. Don't forget the good food this time. The canned stuff. <gasps> did, did someone just say something? There's nobody here but Mochi. Oh, for crap's sake. I find him standing next to the food bowl, looking up at me with those expectant eyes. I gently nudge him with my foot. Did you just say that? Nope. Nope, I'm done. I dump the rest of the canned food into the bowl and scurry out of the kitchen. Then I dump myself into bed. I don't even want to think about it right now. I'm just going to sleep in a real bed for once. Maybe sleeping on that couch is what's messing with my head. I just... I don't usually close the door, but I think it's a good idea tonight. Don't want any home invading cats, huh? <laughs> well, if Mochi, like, was in there and, like, woke up in the morning as a person, I would ROTFL. <laughs> I don't want Mochi whispering to me in my sleep. Wet food. Wet food. <laughs> Give me more wet food. Not the pumpkin, either. Hey. <laughs> Milo likes the pumpkin. I, I, I wake- hate it, but he likes it. 
<laughs> I wake up early enough, I surprise myself. This is gross. Who does this? Normal people. I know, right? I hate it. At least I slept fairly well, all considered. My oh, yeah. cheek hurts. Kind of like I'm getting oh. one of those real powerful zits. Uh-oh. Just, just when I have a job where people see me all day. Uh-oh. What perfect timing. Uh-oh. I cook my legs free of the big blankets and roll off the side of the bed with my usual grace. <laughs> God, this feels gross. I don't have any acne stuff with me here, but maybe Aunt Wendy had something I can put on it. Uh-oh. I trundle over to the vanity to assess the damage. Yeah. Yep, I knew it! <laughs> whisker! That's not a zit! This is a whisker. There is a whisker going out of my face. Is that more Teddy Grams? No, that's Fun Dip. Oh, I was about to say that didn't sound like Teddy Grams. No, this is literal sugar. Flavored sugar. For shame. Why is that a shame? I gave up soda, not sugar. Um, because it won't come out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Oh, I guess I'm not kidding. Nope, that was the line. <laughs> mm-hmm. I thought at first maybe it was mochi's and it got stuck there, but no. Uh, I better call a doctor. It's going out of my face. Mm -hmm. I tried to pluck it. Don't do that, that hurts. That was probably one of the worst ideas I've ever had. Now I know just how sensitive cat whiskers can be. That it helps them see. It's actually like an entire organ too. So like, that's like, oh, let me just like tear out my liver real quick. It's just real quick. Yes. Ain't no thing. Is this really how the curse starts? I've been pacing around for too long. I gotta go to work. But how am I supposed to leave the house like this? What if someone sees me? I guess I could try to cover it with something. <laughs> like a mask. Suck. Oh. oh, hey. I dig around a bit and find some dust masks under the sink. Maybe that'll do the trick. I can pretend I have a gold or something. O or not, because... Trying to put it on feels really awkward against my face. I'm at a loss here. I'd call one of the staffers, but I didn't get their numbers yesterday because I'm a moron and don't know how to call my own workplace. Yep. <laughs> I guess it'd be hard to use the cell phone as a cat anyway. Sure. You only have one whisker. <laughs> right? Well, no, he's talking about the others, so if really tried to call them and they're all like, meow, meow, meow. Ah. Yeah. But I mean, like, <laughs> Look at Finley, though. Okay, Finley was on that phone the entire time you have known her. How much you want to bet Finley is the cat videos? Jelly donut? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just have to go to the cafe and hope someone's there to ask. I didn't run into anybody on my way to the cafe yesterday, but knowing my luck, there will be a whole crowd or something. I keep my head down and walk quickly. Right past this train. Jeez, my <laughs> face itches. I hope another one isn't coming in. I thought it was enough to make me pick up my pace. <laughs> Ring to work is gonna be a theme for me. Maybe it'll keep me in shape. I just hope I can keep my human shape too. I wanna be a secret cat. That'd be kinda fun. <laughs> Why are there so many people milling in front of the cafe today? This is exactly what I was dreading. It's like they showed up specifically to look at the magical mutating cat person. Good TV show. I'd watch it. What, what if they did? <gasps> As I approach the cafe, the whisker falls off like a dead leaf or something. Huh. Look at it just flutter to the floor. I lean down to pick it up. If I hadn't seen it happen, I would have thought it fell off one of the cats. Huh. Okay, this is stupid. This is so stupid. My eyes start to sting as I cry over a stupid cat whisker. <laughs> I can't tell if I should be mad or crying or both. Both. <sighs> this is just really, really stupid and I don't want to deal with it. Dude, you signed the contract to Without turn into reading. a cat. Like, seriously. <laughs> I kick the door open with my foot. What the fluff? But it's actually pretty heavy, so it sort of just nudges open, and then I bruise my foot, and ow, okay. Where the hell is Graves? 
<laughs> Looks like most of them are already here. They're already setting up the table for breakfast. Like this is just a regular, normal day where nobody grows cat whiskers. <laughs> oh, Avery. I don't think he's in yet. What's the matter? My face is the matter. Wait, this is the matter. <laughs> <laughs> this whole dumb situation. You probably can't see the whisker I'm waving around, but I don't care. He knows what I'm talking about. Look at that face on his face. Oh, face is face. that yours? What kind of cat are you? I'm not any kind of cat. I'm a people. <laughs> I can't believe this. Oh, come on, Avery. You should have known this was going to happen. You really should have, like, to be honest, bro. Like, just read the contract. How the hell was I supposed to know? The contract probably says, hey, by the way, you might end up cursed and becoming a cat. And you just, like, It probably says, right I on. guarantee... <laughs> Sounds like somebody here didn't read their contract. The safe areas and other tips are mentioned in the welcome pamphlet.